So, ey, servus Freunde, was geht ab? Justin ist mal wieder am Start hier für euch und damit herzlich willkommen zu einem weiteren Video hier zurück auf meinem Kanal und heute kommen wir mal zu dieser ganzen Face Jarvis Situation. Im Anschluss seht ihr natürlich dann auch die Reaction von Ninja und was Face Jarvis dazu gesagt hat. Lasst auf jeden Fall safe einen Daumen nach oben und ein Abo auf meinem Kanal, da würde mich extrem freuen und ich will auch noch ganz kurz ein kleines Statement dazu abgeben, weil ich die ganzen Kommentare bei Jarvis so unfassbar lächerlich finde, das könnt ihr gar nicht, das könnt ihr gar nicht glauben, es ist echt so unglaublich lächerlich. Der Typ wird einfach nur fertig gemacht, weil er in dem Video weint und es ist einfach nur unfassbar. Ihr müsst euch mal vorstellen, er macht ein Video, wie er von Fortnite Lifetime gebannt ist und wo er weint. Und dann kommen die Leute, die kommentieren, äh, ja, er weint nur wegen Fortnite. Äh, keine Ahnung, wenn du weißt, dass dein Leben vorbei ist, wenn du weinst, weil du kein Fortnite mehr spielen kannst. Und so, solche scheiß Kommentare. Aber die ganzen Leute, die müssen doch bedenken, dass das seine Zukunft war. Nicht nur ja, oh, ich er heult jetzt nur wegen Fortnite oder so, das ist so ein Drecksgelaber. Ihr könnt euch gar nicht vorstellen, wie er sich damit seine Zukunft safen konnte und er hat so unglaublich viel Geld mit Fortnite gemacht. Sein Kanal hat mittlerweile 220 Millionen Aufrufe oder so und 95% dadurch sind durch Fortnite und da er recht werbefreundlichen Content gemacht hat, hat er auch sehr, sehr viel Geld dadurch verdient und auch eine sehr gute CPM gehabt. Ich denke mal bestimmt drei oder vier. das heißt, er hat locker 800k mit seinen ganzen Videos gemacht und es sind ja nur seine Videos. Er war ja auch bei Turnieren und so weiter. Also Fortnite hat theoretisch sein Leben geprägt. Und er hätte sich damit eine finanzielle Absicherung gönnen können. Beziehungsweise er ist ja ein Face. Also ich denke mal, dass er irgendwie auch noch ein paar Einkommen hat. Aber ich denke mal, ihr wisst, was ich meine. Und er heult nicht nur, weil er Fortnite nicht spielen kann. Alter, wie unglaublich dumm ist denn dieser Kommentar oder sind diese Kommentare dort, das macht überhaupt gar keinen Sinn. Einfach mal nachdenken und danach kommentieren, das wäre einfach nicht schlecht. Schreibt auf jeden Fall eure Meinung dazu in die Kommentare. Ich finde auf jeden Fall, Jarvis hat sich verdient, ein bisschen gebannt zu sein, aber auf keinen Fall Lifetime. Jeder macht mal Fehler und ja, nicht nur weil er Fame ist, das ist bei jedem so, ganz ehrlich. Und der Typ ist, glaube ich, noch nicht mal 18, keine Ahnung. Jeder macht mal Fehler und ich finde auf jeden Fall, er hat sich auch verdient, wieder anband zu sein, aber mindestens zwei, drei Monate gebannt wäre auf jeden Fall verdient, würde ich jetzt einfach mal sagen. Und jetzt seht ihr die Reaction von Ninja und daraufhin das Video von Face Jarvis. Wenn euch das Video gefällt, lasst ein Like da und kommt natürlich gerne weiterhin auf meinen Kanal. Lasst auf jeden Fall auch ein Abo da. Haut rein, bis zum nächsten Video und jetzt viel Spaß mit der Reaction. Let's Didn't really go. Think about it. It wasn't in a tournament, it wasn't in a cash cup, it wasn't in a, anything like that. I think that it should be like a six, maybe, maybe like a six month ban from like competitive and like, I don't know, man. Permanent though? I like the hammer, man. I don't know, I, I, man. I, 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 I don't it, know. I think, uh... It's like, I mean, he definitely deserves a punishment, but. So, so wait, were we talking about the Jarvis thing? Yeah, yeah. man. If, if anybody else, let's say an unknown person was You want them permanently banned? Right, you would, I mean, probably, yeah. right? Yeah. So why why would you let someone who is known get away with right. that? Right. I mean right. I mean let's be let's be a little like realistic here though as well. I mean there 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 are people who get you know I say favoritism, but it's like dude you gotta yeah I'd say favoritism is bad. I mean you gotta give you I mean it, but you don't want to slap on the wrist somebody who's a content creator who's like makes a video showing like how. How insane cheats are. I mean, without your content creators as well, though, like, it has a negative impact on your game. Yeah, but I think Fortnite's doing just fine. I agree. I agree. I'm just saying. It's like robbing a bank, right? Let's say you rob a bank. <laughs> you? No, let's say you rob a bank and you're like, your excuse is, oh, I just robbed a bank for, so for content fun. or rob a bank to feed my family or something like that. It won't happen again. You know what I mean? I know it's different severity, I but mean, people like, can people can die when you're a bank. Yeah, it's, it's a good thing. I'm, like, I'm not oh, look at real though. I'm not look how easy though. I could cheat. You know what I mean? I think it's just like I think that it was incredibly stupid, but a permanent ban I think is just silly. The other thing I say, I say is like you also don't want to end the kid's career entirely. Well, that exactly. But that that's that's the the suck. Do you think that's gonna end his career though? I mean, what else is he gonna play? Like he's got to transition over from one of the most popular games and, and literally a game that made him competitively and from his skill and everything that he's accomplished in it. And he's gotta play and he's gotta now literally play another game. He, he has to upload new YouTube content. He can't upload any like he could. I mean, he could do a Tyler one day, which is making new account and only do stuff offline and then like upload videos. 
I mean, 100% it's no, his fault. No, listen, I'm, I, 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 I'm not trying to. I don't, I don't think anyone here is trying to. Like, I don't feel bad for him, right? That makes it. Like, like yeah, I'm, I'm not trying to. Em, I'm not trying to empathize. I'm trying to be just like a little, a little realistic. Okay, like saying that, that you shouldn't have favoritism in a little, in a, a little bit in like in content creators. I mean, that's just kind of silly, man. Like, I'm not saying he. Imagine, I'm not saying he shouldn't get banned at all. I'm not saying he shouldn't get any like, you He should get pumped. He should get punished. Turner. Like, imagine you were a Turner making a YouTube video of you guys cheating. Do you know how many, like, little kids are gonna find out about that cheat and now gonna cheat in these next coming weeks and it's just gonna be so annoying? You don't want, you don't want a double standard either. Like, you don't want to be like, well, okay, you're a content creator, so just don't do this again. Everybody pretty much knows. I mean, don't use, don't use a hack. You right. Know? Like, I mean, I think in six month ban, one year ban, and, and he's back. That's what I, that's what I, I think that's fair. I mean, there were people who, like, didn't hack, but they cheated, and they got, like, a two-week ban, and then they qualified for Worlds. Like, where do, where do... Yeah, but that's how, that's, 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 they're, like, as much as I hate Ziff and Ronaldo, right? It's like so different. Learn from, from that. Right. Yeah, so, like, let, let, let me, let me, I don't, I guess I don't fully understand. Did he, did he tell people where to get the hacks in, as well in the video and stuff? That's like, no. I, I, no, I, he just did it. So he but just like, did it. So he, it, like, so he didn't post totally a website. Didn't he didn't, like, say, here's this link, like. As far as you know, I, I didn't see it. You don't want to let somebody cheat and then be like, well, because you're you, you know, we're just going to do this. Don't do it again. Why are all these guys? There's one white over there. Everybody else gets full ban. I think when I was young, if I was younger, I would have 100% been, uh, like, complete up in arms, like, ban him. Oh, my God, what an idiot. But as I, I'm older, I'm more experienced. I... I just feel like let's stop acting like there isn't favoritism in the world. There is. Like let's stop acting like Did you did you just older, more experienced me? I don't know, man. I feel like you should be I feel like you should be on my on my wavelength as well here. Like he's young, dude. He didn't like th there are people who have done worse things on the internet in different areas and, and haven't gotten banned. Uh, I use Logan Paul as a reference. The dude literally filmed someone hanging in a forest and the channel didn't get banned and he's been perfectly fine. He uploaded an apology video and he was set. Uh, I get what I'm you're saying, saying. I'm saying in that aspect, he was a YouTuber. He was a big one. He didn't get banned. Like the YouTube decided, hey, this guy gets a lot of videos, a lot of stuff on our on our on our, on our website. Like, like that was a, a per perfect favoritism moment, right? And like wait, wait, real and realistically, it from YouTube standpoint, like they. I mean, I think I think it should have ended up the punishment should have been way worse. But it's like that for didn't happen for Logan. There are lines, man. I think this is. I think this is one where it's like Jarvis, dude, you're an idiot. Six month ban, maybe three months. First offense, like young kid. Come on, man. I mean, like, come on, man. Like, like, let's say, like, like, let's be serious. Like, if, if, if there's a difference, there's a difference between. A lot of hate listen, for two weeks, so maybe they're scared. To listen, go listen. There's a difference between a content creator who has a, a millions of subscribers, hundreds of thousands of followers. Who gets banned from from literally what makes him money, right? His his and there's a difference between some kid who is a is a just a piece of shit who has absolutely zero following, has zero money that comes from Fortnite from from gaming, and hacks. You ban that kid, nothing happens to him. Nothing happens. Oh no, he can't cheat anymore. You ban Jarvis, it's like it's different. The stakes are different. It should be handled a little bit differently. That's my opinion. That would be, then you would just go by the favoritism. Like it's just, dude, it's just, it, it's not even, it, it's literally, it's just, just look at the situation. It's different. It needs to be handled different because it's different. There's you can't say, you can't, there. you can't say that a con, I mean, like, a content creator cheating whose entire life is about what the game is playing, and then some random who has dude, no YouTube channel, no Twitter account, he doesn't even care, he just cheats, he hacks a hack. You ban, you ban one, you ruin his life. You ban the other, now he, he makes another account, keeps cheating, like, you know what I'm saying? It's different, it has to Okay, I'm making this video today for the whole of the Fortnite community and for all of my fans. I, I generally don't even know how to start this video off. I, I never thought I'd be having to make this kind of video, but I just have to today. It's obvious that Fortnite has changed my life forever and the amount of people's lives it's changed is just crazy. It's allowed me to pursue my dream and do what I love doing 
every day. Ever since Fortnite came out, since like two years ago now, I have devoted every hour to become better at the game and just genuinely have fun playing the game. I don't even know how many hours now I've spent creating content on Fortnite for you guys and it's been the best two years of my life. It's genuinely insane how big of an impact this game has had on my life and I wouldn't be here without this game. I, I'm not even sure what I would be doing right now if Fortnite wasn't a thing. You know, this game has helped me build my platform. It's helped me meet some of the craziest and most awesome people that I would never dream of meeting. The amount of lifelong friends and the memories I've had from this game have just been so amazing. It's, it's really crazy. This game has brought so many people from so many different countries together. And it just blows my mind that that's even possible. Okay, with that being said, this next part of the video is gonna be uh, it's gonna be really tough, and I'm not really sure how I how to say this, but I just have to say this so that no one makes the same mistake I have done. Whew. I'm not sure how many of you know this, but I've actually been permanently banned on Fortnite for life. Recently, I posted some videos of me using aimbot in solos and playground mode. And just all I was thinking about whilst I was making those videos was just how entertaining and like interesting these videos would be for you guys to watch. It didn't even cross my mind to think that I could be banned for life on Fortnite from from those videos. I just want to be clear, this is my first time I've ever done anything like this, and of course I have never done this in a competitive game mode at all. You know, at the time I posted those videos, I was completely oblivious to what could happen to me, like what the consequences were. Obviously this was a huge mistake and it's completely wrong on my end. You know, I really don't know what to be, like genuinely I don't even know what I was thinking like cheating in anything is just terrible you should never do it it's not acceptable it's zero tolerance you should it's just it's just such a dumb thing to do I should have paid more attention to the community rules and the TOS of Fortnite and like yeah, I just want to urge you guys all to review all of those terms of services and stuff so that nothing like this could ever happen to you because Oh, it's, it's, it's actually so shit. Yeah, I genuinely don't know what to say. Like, this, uh, just, just knowing that I can never play Fortnite again or, like, create, or even, like, create, oh, you know, it's crazy that I, I'm, I can never play Fortnite again or even create content for you guys. You know, it's, it's obvious that I made a massive mistake. And of course, I would never think about doing anything like this again. You know, when I was making those videos, I never thought about the consequence. I never, I never thought about the consequences that could happen from me making those videos. I just thought about, I just thought about entertaining you guys. You know, the amount of happiness I get from playing Fortnite every day is crazy. Like just waking up and being able to play the game is just so much fun. And now, now I I can't I can't play Fortnite at all. I've been permanently banned. Like you know, I I know how much you guys all love Fortnite and how much you love watching me play Fortnite. It, you know, it's it's crazy how one game can genuinely just change your life forever. And it's just allowed me to become a regular part of your lives where you you get home from school or work or whatever, and you just watch my videos. Like it's truly amazing to me. This also makes me so sad because I just know now that I can never go to any other events or like even be a part of the Fortnite community. Just like the amount of opportunity. Oh, Obviously this is going to prevent me from going to any other events or even exploring other opportunities and especially meeting you guys at these tournaments. You know, it's just it's so crazy. You know, I love this game so much. I'm still gonna love this game. Holy fuck. So hard. Oh. You know, I'm still gonna love this game no matter what happens. Like, I just wish I could have known how badly I was messing up because I would never have ever thought of even making those kind of videos if I knew that this could have actually happened. I know now how big of a mistake this was and like, I, it's just, there's, there's nothing I can. <laughs> Epic Games, you know, I I know how big of a mistake I made. I like. I'm truly like so sorry. Epic, I know I have to take accountability for my actions, and you know I'm gonna I'm gonna do my best to accept any punishment that like comes my way, whatever happens. I'm not trying to find like a quick road out, but like being banned forever is just like thinking about a lifetime ban is just it's, oh I just didn't 
I, I, I didn't expect this would, would happen. Especially from a game, you know, that I love so much. Like, I've never made a video like this. And, you know, I never thought, never thought I would have to. Oh, I can't, I can't speak. You know, all I ever want is just, like, a chance to be able to play Fortnite again. Like, that's all I want to do is just play Fortnite. I, you know, I just want to do what I truly love the most in life. And it's just impossible. And I have no idea what I'm going to do next. But just know I'm not going to go anywhere. Like, it, what, whatever happens, I'm going to carry on making content for you guys. Of course, like, I love you guys so much. I appreciate, like, all the support you guys have shown me over the last two years. Like, it's just so... Like, just crazy how much love you guys have shown towards me. And, like, I'm so disappointed in myself for doing this and not thinking about, like, the consequences that could have happened. No, I just wish I could go back in time and just change all of this to make it never happen. Yeah, I'm just, like, I'm sorry to everybody watching this video. I don't really know what else to say. Like, I love you. Like, you guys generally don't understand how much each and every one of you mean to me. But, yeah, that's, uh, that's the end of the video, guys. This is, this is, this is it. Um, I'll see you in my next one. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know.